First we're going to cast on and so we're just going to take the yarn, do a slip knot, put it on peg one. And then we're going to take the working yarn and we're going to take our hook and we're going to go through the loop with the hook and we're going to take the working yarn and just feed it through that to make a loop. So we have a loop here and I'm just going to take the other end here and tighten it and I'm just going to wind it over there. And then we're going to do a crochet cast on that leaves a nice chain on the bottom. It's my favorite one for doing um, scarves. If I want a flatter one, I have another one I do, but this one's really nice when you want a chain look on the bottom. We just take the loop and go around the peg, take the working yarn, pull it through the loop, and snug it up. Go behind the next one, put the working yarn through the loop, and snug it up. Go through the next one, take the working yarn through the loop, and just snug it up. And we just do that all the way to the last peg. And I always come in and check and make sure I've got a good tension because I want the cast on row to be nice and tight so the loops look good, but I want it to be loose enough to go over. I don't want it to be so tight I can't knit that off. So I just check and this would, and you can easily adjust them if you need to. So I'm just going to finish doing this cast on all the way to the end here. And then we just put this loop over the last peg, tighten it, and then I'm just going to come and knit it over.